Stand up 182. Here's Dom Lau. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is three rounds of three minutes in a one super series lightweight kickboxing contest. Introducing first, out of the blue corner, he is an ISKA kickboxing world champion, standing at 182 centimeters tall, holding a striking record of 54 wins and 10 losses. Training out of Fight Club Ferenczi, representing Italy. Put your hands together for Mustafa Dynamite Haida. And now, introducing his opponent out of the red corner, he is a multiple time kickboxing world champion, standing at 182 centimeters tall, holding a kickboxing record of 21 wins and 14 losses. Trigger out of Team Holtzkin Helmon, representing the Your referee in charge, Mr. Atsushi Onari. Hey, how are you doing? Okay, it's been three okay? No elbow, no elbow, no winching. Final instructions from referee Atsushi Onari. Lock the front door, put the kids to bed. Turn out the lights because things are about to get crazy. Inside the sold-out Singapore Indoor Stadium, a one Super Series yes. kickboxing clash yes. of the highest yes. level. Five-time world champion Nicky Holtzkin against kickboxing no. world champion Mustafa Haider. Holtzkin in the black, Haider in the white. Southpaw stance on Haider. Comes off that win over eight-time world champion Daniel Dawson last year. Holtzkin who knocked Cosmo Alexander onto the astral plane. Holtzkin on the inside, look for the uppercuts, look for the straight right hands. Ida needs to be at full strength tonight. Needs to work his angles. Cannot stay a stagnant target in front of Holtzkin. Big low kick from Holtzkin, chopping out that lead thigh early. Holtzkin, who was once trained by the great, the late Ramon Decker, the turbine from hell. Sets the right hand, decides to go downstairs with a leg kick. Haider could not be intimidated here, could not be backed up. You see Holtzkin controlling center ring. Forcing Haider to the outside, as he did against Cosmo Alexander. Loves up high here on Holtzkin, he's got tremendous respect for Haider. Says on paper, Haider is an easier opponent than Cosmo. Having his way in here, Nicky Holtzkin. Michael, a lot of his opponents have made that same mistake. They underestimate Haida, and he capitalizes Stop. on that. Break. He makes people pay Go. for taking him lightly. Holtzkin tucking the chin, looking through the brow, going to the body. Haida taking his time here. Just seeing what Holtzkin's got to offer. Left hook there from Nicky Holtzkin. 14 and 1 pro boxing record, 11 knockouts for Holtzkin. Going to the midsection, belly button through the back. There's the inside thigh kick from the Dutchman. Haider could not be backed into that corner, gets out of there now. Good right hand lead there from Holtzkin, smack bang between the eyes. And referee Oh now he breaks them. Five time world champion Nicky Holtzkin goes to the legs now. Inside thigh of Haider. Haider cracks away to the upper right rib cage, leans back like Fat Joe. Nice evasion from the Italian. There's the left hand down the corridor from the southpaw. And again, Holtzkin goes to the legs. 
you know, which one way to slow down the boxing of your opponent is to take down his thighs. Yeah, but he's having a hard time fighting that range. You can just see the pressure coming from Mickey Holskin. He's walking forward, and it's basically target practice at this. Holskin's got to, uh, Haida's got to earn the respect with some big shots. Now he does it. That's a nice little left hand landed by Haida. Clever combination there from Haida. A bit of Petrosian-esque, you could say. Left hand followed by the liver shot off the same hand. Both then Trey Roundhouse kicks Haida to the midsection. Holskin downstairs. We are seeing excellence in execution under these one super serious kickboxing rules. Spinning kick there from Nicky Holt. He's starting to get comfortable. He's starting to let things go a little bit more. 3-2 combination from the five-time world champion ends the opening round. Man, here's what Nicky likes to do. He's starting to get comfortable. He's starting to figure out Haida. There he is, catching the body kick and then chopping down the legs of Haida. There he is doing it again. He moves forward. He's reading what Haida's doing. Answers with a nice little left hook. Touches the chin of Haida. Impressive first round from Holskin. Team Holskin has really put together a very precise game plan for this matchup. And it's starting to come to fruition. Haida has got to do something to change things up. You can see the Petrosians in his corner barking orders at him. Giorgio Petrosian is letting him know that left hook, that worked. That was good. Let's go back to the body. Let's start breaking down whole skin. Let's earn some respect. Giorgio Petrosian in the corner of Mustafa Haida. Petrosian, a one super series athlete, also undefeated, the greatest kickboxer on the planet. Here we go, inside the sold-out Singapore Indoor Stadium. It's one championship called the Greatness. Between them both, these two men hold six world titles in Muay Thai and kickboxing. Five to the man in black, one to the man in white. Roundhouse kick brought in the humorous, but there was nothing funny about it. Haida, good lead hand, just brought Holtzkin to the orbital. Holtzkin leads with the jab, you'll see him try and pressure Haida back towards the ropes. Holtzkin loves to control center ring, stamp his authority. You can see the size difference. Nicky Holtzkin looks to be a little bit thicker, a little bit bigger than Haida. And that, remember, Haida's last match against Dawson was at a lighter division, so Haida's coming up for this one. Right hand followed by a tipping liver shot there from Nicky Holtzkin. We'll try and tick those knuckles between the ninth and 10th ribs, try and impact the vagus nerve and close down the entire body. It said the most painful way a martial artist could be knocked out is by a liver shot. Uppercut there from Holtzkin. It was the uppercut that knocked out Cosmo Alexander last time out. High right roundhouse kick from the Dutchman. There's an uppercut from Hyder on the inside. Thought about a step through knee, but Holtzkin just sweeps up the left leg. That was beautiful. Low sweep there from the man from the Netherlands. It's a beautiful combination that he throws. Things put together like he's conducted a symphony. He goes to the body with the liver shot, then he goes up top with the head kick, and then he just waits, he pirouettes out to the side, and he dumps Hyder to the ground. You can see the skill set why Holtzkin has accumulated five world championships, why he's considered one of the best on the planet right now. Finding range with the jab, setting the right hand with the low kick here, Holtzkin. Double forearm guard against the left round kick from Haider. Haider front kick to the midsection. Long reach on the uppercut. There's one off the lead hand. Public enemy number one of the southpaw is the straight right cross. Good left hook there from Holtzkin. Gotta be careful not to drop that right glove, Mustafa Haider. No elbows allowed under this kickboxing rule set. There's another tipping little shot to an upstairs right hand and the roundhouse kick off the back leg from Holtzkin. Haider starting to push forward. He's starting to throw a little bit of more combinations in the second and half of this second round. But Nicky Holtzkin still very much in control. Nice little jumping switch knee landed there from Holtzkin. Left hook, right hand, tries to the headache maker. Mustafa Haida ties him up. They waltz back into the corner. Oh, no, he separates them. Under 30 seconds remaining. You've seen a very good contest. Haida backs him up with the left hand. That being the power hand of the southpaw. Haida cracks away to the forearm. Holtzkin goes downstairs. Front kick to the midsection to the solar plexus. Step up knee. The lead and break from Holtzkin. Backs Haida against the ropes. Haida ties him up. Ready? Go! 
gripping contest this one. Six world titles between them. Five-time world champion Nikki Holtzkin and a world kickboxing champion Mustafa Haider. Look how he closes the distance here. You can see he evades his way, gets into the clinch, and a beautiful jumping switch knee just grazes the nose of Haida a little bit deeper, and that could have been the end of Haida's night. But he just needed a little bit more pull down on the head. You can start to see Holskins getting relaxed. Neither one of these two taking a stool. So expect them to put everything out there in this third and final round. Haida is not out of this. He can, he can bounce right back in to the, this match with a nice knockdown of Nikki Holskin. You can see he landed a beautiful left hand in the middle part of that second round. He faked the knee. Holskin reacted. And Haida came straight down with the left hand. So I'd like to see more of that. I like how he's setting those things up, faking one thing, throwing more feints, getting Holskin to react, and then landing big shots of his own. Third and final round. Martin Van Bello in the corner of Holskin has been training Nick for 12 years. Holskin formerly trained by the all-time great Ramon Decker, the late Ramon Decker. Third and final southpaw stance on the kickboxing world champion Mustafa Haida. Orthodox stance on the five-time world champion Nicky Holskin. Holskin fakes off the right. Jab two from Holskin. Good evasion from Haida. You feel that Holskin's going to up the intensity, up the aggressor meter a little more here. Low kick from the Dutchman. Haida chin tucked, fires up on the tag. Front kick to the midsection there from Holskin. Turning quick off the lead hand. Double four runs guard against the high round kick. Good little quarter angle turn back to centering from Haida. His corner telling him not to back up, and he backs up Holskin. That's more like it from the Italian Moroccan. Roundhouse kick to the upper right mid gap. Trying to stand his ground here, Haida. Nicky Holtzman goes to the liver. You hit the liver, you will impact that right side of the body. It's quite a large target, not fully protected by the ribs. Jumping knee there, trying for the headache maker. Holtzman getting airborne. Haida with the left hand. Nice evasion, though, from the Italian. Holtzman putting some power behind that lead hook. But you see Haida's different game plan here. The corner have told him, don't walk backwards. Don't go towards the ropes. Stand your ground to not allow Nicky Holtzkin to bully you. And so far, we see Haida occupying the center of the ring a lot more than he has in the previous two rounds, Trent. And he's utilizing the turns very well. He's pirouetting out to the side, out to the left, and the right. But he's not throwing anything off of these turns. He's just pirouetting, moving, cutting the angles, but he's not really answering back. Now it looks like he got a little bit of, bit of damage coming out of the face there of Haida. Knees of Holskin. Straight left down the tube again from Haida. Thought about a spinning back fist the Italian. There's another cross from the southpaw. He goes to the liver section. One minute remaining, third and final round of this one super series kickboxing match. Nicky Holskin, the five time world champion, throws another pulverizing right hand. Then goes to the inside lead thigh. Holskin the inside now. A chance for the knees. And referee O'Nari gives him a slap and a tickle. He'll get the cut on that. Haida looked at here, I believe. There will be an injury time break here. Haida looks like he's got a cut over the left eye. Referee Onari says that it was a punch that opened up Haida above his left eye right there. Two doctors are looking at the cut. Meanwhile, they are wiping off Nicky Holskin in the neutral corner. He is not allowed to be in his own corner, not allowed to receive any instructions from his trainer, Martin Van Pillow. Holskin did predict a knockout in the first round. We're not going to see that. Can he still knock out Mustafa Haida here in the third round? Haida predicted he would outpoint Nicky Holskin tonight. Looks like we got 44 seconds left in the third and final round of this one, so both these guys need to turn it on right now. And Haida, the kickboxing world champion, comes out all guns blazing. The southpaw trying to back up the touch man. Holtzman goes to the inside guard. Oh, he's he's by he's 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 the combination from Overhand right from Holtzman. Here comes the heavy artillery. Belly button through the back. Step through the knee. Whipping high kick, turning back fist there from Haida. Goes down the center line. Then goes upstairs. Step through me for the touchdown. Final seconds of the contest. Turning left off. Low check there from Haida. What a match. What a show between these two amazing world champions. Very tough. Nikki Holt.
Kowalski was beating up the inside of that leg. But he was, I like how he's faking these kicks. He's consistently pushing forward, throwing these feints. But there's Haida coming forward. There's Holski catching it with the double forearms. And then he takes to the skies and he starts to spin. Boom, going up top. Landing the spinning wheel kick to the heel, to the side of the head of Haida. Impressive exhibition put on by Nikki Holskin. I think he won all three rounds. What do you think so, Michael? Three judges ringside scoring in a 10 point plus system. The winner of the round gets 10 points. The less dominant boxer gets nine points. There were no knockdowns, so no 10 8 rounds. Let's go to Tom Lau and find out our winner. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of battle, we turn now to the judges' scorecards. All three judges have called this fight in favor of your winner by unanimous decision from the Series. Look at the sportsmanship, the martial arts values of honor, integrity, and respect. The martial arts Bushido code being shown by both these amazing athletes, both these world champions. Who's next for Nikki Holtz? Can you gotta wonder? Maybe Elliot Compton, maybe Rick Ursel. Time will tell. But the natural Nikki Holtz can still undefeated here in one. Folks, coming up after the break, a quarterfinal in the one look. 